What Causes Greenhouse Gases to Increase? by kscience.com This represents a simple diagram of the Earth and this dashed line represents the upper limit of Earth's atmosphere. So within this area is the atmosphere and the atmosphere contains gases including N2 which is nitrogen, O2 which is oxygen, CO2 which is carbon dioxide, CH4 which is methane and H2O which is water vapour. Water vapour, methane and carbon dioxide are all greenhouse gases, whereas oxygen and nitrogen are not greenhouse gases. We're now going to focus on what causes the greenhouse gases, carbon dioxide and methane to increase. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Here I'm drawing diagrams to represent animals, trees, and microorganisms. And in this case, this is bacteria. These organisms are living things, and living things respire. And because all living things respire, all of these organisms release carbon dioxide into Earth's atmosphere. Respiration is a chemical reaction where oxygen reacts with glucose to produce carbon dioxide and water. Remember, all living things respire, releasing carbon dioxide into Earth's atmosphere. Fossil fuels are also responsible for releasing carbon dioxide into Earth's atmosphere. Coal, oil and natural gas are all fossil fuels. That's coal, oil and natural gas. They all contain carbon. The combustion of these fossil fuels is what releases carbon dioxide into Earth's atmosphere. This is a chemical reaction where oxygen reacts with fossil fuels to produce carbon dioxide and water. So for example, this car uses petrol or diesel in its engine and the combustion of this fossil fuel will release carbon dioxide into Earth's atmosphere. In another example, the combustion of this coal when it's being heated will also release carbon dioxide into Earth's atmosphere. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Photosynthesis is a chemical reaction where carbon dioxide reacts with water to produce glucose and oxygen. So trees and plants are really good for decreasing carbon dioxide from the air as any carbon dioxide in the air will be absorbed and taken in for photosynthesis. However, if deforestation takes place, which is the cutting down of trees, any carbon dioxide that's in the atmosphere will stay in the atmosphere as the cutting down of trees means the carbon dioxide is not able to be absorbed or taken in by the trees. So let's say more carbon dioxide is added to the atmosphere due to respiration and combustion. Because photosynthesis cannot take place, this means carbon dioxide levels increases. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. In this last section, we're now going to discuss how methane, which is CH4, is added to the Earth's atmosphere. This diagram represents grass, and this grass is eaten by cows. Now imagine, all around the world, there are nearly 1 billion cows which are farmed for their milk and beef. Nearly 1 billion cattle graze, which emits CH4, methane. To graze just means eating, so nearly 1 billion cattle all around the world are constantly grazing on grass where they are then emitting a lot of methane into Earth's atmosphere. Another source of methane are rice farms, also known as paddy fields. 
As rice farming takes place, these paddy fields release methane into Earth's atmosphere. Another source of methane are landfill sites. Landfill sites are areas which contain a lot of rubbish and waste from households and businesses. Landfill sites contain very large mounds of rubbish which are responsible for emitting large amounts of methane into Earth's atmosphere. Another source of methane are swamps. This swamp contains algae which is on the surface of the water and when the algae dies, the algae sinks to the bottom. So when the algae sinks to the bottom, there is no oxygen at the bottom of the swamp. Therefore, the algae decays, which causes methane to be released into Earth's atmosphere. So it's the decay of dead organisms which releases methane. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Pause the video here to practice the keywords. The answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com and don't forget to like and subscribe.